ou la po bachou de tout, ta kou tua na tu stoppe la po, na tu dengue la po, ba ja tu grepe du la kongon. Pa yfe nga na tu ninge nge pinkele, ka ke fumbo ta funde ke tuka kongon. We removed our structure and the police said we should not continue building because we grabbed land. What should we do? If every time we go to the municipality looking for assistance, they tell us to find land to occupy. The police was here and we removed our structures. We were chased from places we were renting and our children are on the streets. <laughs> The shack I was renting is 1,200 Namibian dollars, but I'm no longer employed. I don't know where I'll get the money. I came here to grab land, but we are apparently grabbing land. Now, how will I survive? Valves by rural councillor Donate Stegako said he was out of town when residents grab land. Similarly, Valves by rural constituency office administrator Ruben Shikongo also denied telling the group to grab land. Meanwhile, Valves Bay Mayor Trovino Forbes blamed instigators who want to jeopardize the municipal council's efforts in addressing the land issue in the coastal town. We are, we are in the process of registering people for Farm 37. And this really just goes to show a lot of disrespect for what we are trying to do uh, for the residents of Wolfish Bay. It's really um, discomforting to see such behavior. Now, these people that um, take part in these illegal activities, why they do so, I do not know. Some were told that there is land available, they must just go and put up their pins. So this boils down again to instigation. Recently, we've seen a 